Why am I so tired? How the devil are you? This is Cirque. And this is your high star. Welcome back to the Grand Legacy, where I think wrapping things up here with Lazarus. There is nothing to think about, my dear. You are indeed one of the prophesized fate bound. What's this now? A fate bound? Me? The prophesized fate bound are those who will seek to extract the armaments and protect them from falling into the hands of the Dark Prince's protege. Dark Prince? I love his music! Dark Red Corvette? It's in the hands of these unfortunate souls that the Grand's future lies. I don't understand. You must stop the protege? You must prevent the invasion? You haven't said anything about how I'm supposed to stop the Magna Feud. You will stop the Magna Feud by giving it a better name. I need to defeat our current enemy before I can start worrying about some future foe. Have a little faith. Because you gotta have faith, the faith, the faith. You've gotta have faith, the faith, the faith. Oh yeah! You will find the answer to end all conflicts once you have gathered all the armaments. Let's say I do this. What do I need to prevent the invasion? There is a mentor waiting for you. You must meet her, for she is the gu is to guide you through your duty. <laughs> duty. This is even more complicated than I thought. I came to find a way to end the Mugna feud. Now you're asking me to prevent an invasion from another world? I think I'm starting to regret my decision to come find you. There is a reason why the prophesied saviors are called the Fate Bell. It is fate that leads them, just as it has led you to me. Enough! I'm sorry, but this is your responsibility now. The prophecy has decreed it so. Enough! Calm down, my dear. Raising your voice won't do you any good. You must listen to me. <coughs> you are stronger than you think. Lear has chosen you, so I expect great things from you. For only the flame and the fate bell can end this chaos. The flame? Yes, my dear Aria. My god, she probably could have gone and found one of the almonds already if we just stopped talking. The more questions I ask you, the more questions I ask you, the more I try to get you to make everything clear, the more confusing your answers become. Yes, six pounds fifty. Six Please, you have to tell me more. What is this flame? Oh my god, stop talking. The last verse of the prophecy, the flame will prevent the second reign. Prevent, not end. But you must remember that there is only so much a prophecy can do. The rest is entirely up to you. I'm not sure I'm up to the task, but I'll do my best, Lazarus. There is one more thing. Oh, God damn it! Lazarus whispers something to Arya. <gasps> really? That big? I, I don't understand. The Spellbearer will. The Spellbearer? Your mentor. She will be waiting for you in Phineas, near the Dark Tree. She bears the spell to extract the armaments from the trees. <sighs> but she will be very difficult to persuade. She's over a hundred years old. Why does her age make her... Like, are you saying that when people get older, they're harder to persuade? Because I thought old people were easy to scam. That's why they're the targets of scams. What? hundred-year-old witch. Wow, I'm still here too. Indeed, she's a very tough lady and not very trusty, but those words will make her believe in you. Do you promise that we'll put to an end to all the war? I promise that this is the only way to finally bring peace to the ground. As I said before, have a little faith, dear Ariel. Thank you, Lazarus. No, the Grand will thank you for bearing such a burden. Now that I have fulfilled, right? yes, fill my de duty, we should part ways. What? You gonna leave us just like that? But I still have so many questions. What's the your questions will be answered throughout your journey. Don't worry. Remember, you can look up the wiki I already told you about. Please, you have to go. You have 
Let me take you to the entrance. Alright, we're outside again. I gotta deal with this damn desert. I'm grateful that you have come to lift this burden from my shoulders. Farewell, dear Aria. Wait, you can't just leave like this. I. Ah! Oh, he evaporated into light. Wait, did he become a giant bird? What happened there? Miss Aria, what just happened? Uh, that was my question too. Lazarus imparted the true verses to us, so his purpose in this world has ended. And the light that flew into the sky? That was the Eye of Lear, a symbol of the afterlife. I've read about it. It means Lazarus has departed. Still, seeing the Eye was beautiful. He passed away? He departed to a higher place. He has earned his freedom at long last. He said he destroyed civilizations back in the old world. It might seem like he did, but the truth is he's a hero of the ancient times. Everything he did, he did to prevent wars and protect the future. Our very existence is the legacy he left behind. The Legrand legacy. I don't like the idea that our world is on the brink of extinction. I just got to see it. I don't like it any more than you do, but apparently I have to stop it from happening. We still don't know whether it's going to happen or not. And yet it might. I have a duty to fulfill that. So are you going to do it, Miss Aaron? I don't appear to have a choice, do I? Lazarus seems so adamant about it. After I find the Spellbearer, I'll find the other Fatebound. Like Lazarus said, this is a burden I must bear. Oh, now we've got more guys. Tell me, brother, why are we still fighting this war? Because we have to spread our influence throughout the South. No, brother, that's not why. We're fighting for glory. That's reason enough. But going on the offensive against Fandor never used to be They're our way. Colors. What? They're different colors. They're people. What do you mean? Him. Look at him. Yeah. Apparently him. Oh, you mean the people in the... Is he standing on top of his shadow? Like it's a platform? It looks like he's standing on top of his shadow. Like it's a platform. He's like... Whoop. Yeah. But look at... They're, they armor. have bluish hair and red eyes. I wonder the if they're armor, related to Finn. The armor looks um, gold, and when you go up to here, it's just got mm -hmm. black. Never used to be, but it is now. So we're abandoning our defensive stance? Being defensive has led us nowhere. Now we're bringing glory to Altia with each victory. We're performing feats of valor that our father could only have dreamt of. Father wouldn't have, father wouldn't have disapproved of our actions. Dead men can't disapprove of anything. But what about about our brother? Yeah, I wonder if Finn's the brother. Well, the same goes for him, brother. As far as I remember, you were the only one who did the deed. You were the one who did the deed. Sorry. Oh wait, they're saying he's dead. So I'm guessing he's not. But you ordered it! Yes, I did. And I did so with a heavy heart. And our troops' morale took a hit because of it. We can't deny his strength. Please, he was a foolish idealist. More of a nuisance than anything else. You speak too highly of him, brother. He played a key role in the army. That's all. Keeping our alliance safe is far more important than hanging on to a man whose beliefs could have destroyed it. What are you talking about? We've signed a treaty, what and if we take prisoners for them, they will send us the help we so desperately need. His foolish idealism, his insistence on sowing fear by slaughtering everyone we were using as leverage, was just unacceptable. Wait, what? He almost made us cross swords with our own ally. So they're saying that whoever they're talking about was an idealist who wanted to murder people. But they won't even send us any reinforcements until we take back the pass. We need their food and supplies, and they need human slaves. It's the perfect trade, if I do say so myself. I know what fifth eight. I know what ten plus five is. Yeah. Fifteen. Yes. Fifteen. 
With their supplies, our troops' morale will be boost bolstered. So we have to take back the pass. I see you're finally listening to me. Assemble all the captains. It's time for the Altean banners to rise on the mountain. This time we take the mountain pass for good. And remember to take as many prisoners as possible. Yes, my liege. I like Gunther's character design the most out of anyone so far. The guy with the eye patch. And the cool hair. And the cool armor. Oh, the one that I really like for his armor. Good. Dismissed. Ghetto? No. Ghetto was good. But um, that Aria? one that we just saw then. Lazarus? Yeah. Yeah, Lazarus's design's cool too. Miss Aria? What is it now? Can you take me to Shapur now? Of course, a promise is a promise. Follow me to the southeast. Thank you. What? Well, that's southeast? Alright. I'm just gonna go back to save, or heal, save, and then we'll pick this up in the next one. Oh, we're in chapter 2. Alright, that's it for this one. Ciao for now!